10 huge EastEnders spoilers for next week. Welcome back to the channel, get ready because we've got 10 huge EastEnders spoilers for next week. From August 12 to 16, things are heating up in Walford. Linda is rushed to the hospital with her life hanging by a thread, Cindy and Junior are doing whatever it takes to keep their affair under wraps, and Freddie stumbles upon Anna's hidden feelings. It's going to be a week full of drama that you won't want to miss. Before we dive into all the juicy details, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on any EastEnders updates. Junior hires Peter Peter, is annoyed that Bobby got the manager position at Beale's Eels instead of him, and believes it's due to their family's issues. Lauren suggests there must be another reason, as Cindy wouldn't help Bobby without some hidden agenda. Junior overhears Peter, Lauren and Gina talking about Cindy, and, to keep Peter distracted, offers him a job on his new contract. 2. Nish has an idea Nish has already stirred the pot for Suki and Eve by bringing Aisha into the mix, knowing full well that the old friends reconnecting could spell trouble. But Nish isn't one to leave things half done. Next week, he's taking it up a notch, determined to throw a real spanner in the works. He's got a plan to make Aisha an offer she might find hard to refuse, and he's betting it'll cause even more tension between Suki and Eve. Nish knows exactly what he's doing. He's not just offering Aisha something out of the blue. He's calculated, thinking a few steps ahead and aiming straight for the cracks in Suki and Eve's relationship. By dangling this opportunity in front of Aisha, he's hoping to push the couple to their breaking point, knowing that jealousy and mistrust could easily creep in. His move is all about control and power, and he's not afraid to use whatever means necessary to get what he wants. 3. Gina gives Anna advice. Gina tries to talk some sense into Anna, pointing out that it's not right to keep leading Bobby on if her heart's really set on Freddy. She's concerned that Anna's playing with fire by not being honest about her feelings, and it's bound to end in someone getting hurt. Gina's just trying to protect Bobby and make sure things don't get messier than they already are, but Anna's having none of it. She brushes off Gina's concerns and insists that everything's fine with her and Bobby. To her, there's no issue. She's convinced they're a great match and that Gina's just overthinking things. Anna's so wrapped up in her own world that she's not seeing the bigger picture, and it's clear she's determined to keep things going with Bobby, whether or not her true feelings for Freddy are lurking in the background. Linda's life is in danger. Linda's been hitting the bottle hard again, and Johnny's at a loss for what to do. He's desperate to help, but feels completely out of his depth. That's when Gina steps in, offering to take care of Linda for a while, giving Johnny a much-needed break. Johnny reluctantly agrees, hoping that some time away might help him clear his head and figure out how to reach his mum. Later, when Johnny comes back to the pub, he's met with a nightmare. He and Linda get into a massive argument, with emotions running high on both sides. Needing to cool off, Johnny steps away for a moment, but when he returns, he's hit with the shock of his life. Linda's in a dire situation, and suddenly, everything spirals out of control. Johnny's left reeling, realizing that things have gotten far worse than he ever imagined. 5. Cindy makes an excuse Cindy finds out that Peter is going to work for Junior and is furious. In response, she offers him the manager's job at Beale's Eels, fully prepared to demote Bobby if needed. Her plan doesn't work, so Cindy demands Junior not to hire Peter, but he stands firm with his job offer. Lauren is suspicious and asks Cindy why she's so determined to stop Peter working with Junior. Cindy desperately attempts to cover her tracks by telling a lie which discredits Junior. 6. Phil gives Rice a deadline Amy's over the moon about Sonia and Rice's engagement, full of excitement and eager to celebrate. She's buzzing with happiness for Sonia, wanting to see every detail, especially that engagement ring. But there's a bittersweet edge to it all for Sonia. She's carrying the weight of disappointment, unable to share the ring with Amy, which casts a shadow over what should be a joyful time. The whole situation leaves Sonia feeling a bit down, even as everyone else is thrilled. As the week goes on, the tension ramps up when Phil decides it's time to confront Rice. He tracks him down at the boxing den, and things get serious fast. Phil isn't messing around. He demands that Rice sort out the money from the fake investment scheme by Monday, no excuses. Phil's tone makes it clear that he means business, and Rice is left under intense pressure, realizing he's in deeper trouble than he thought. With the engagement still fresh, Rice now has this looming threat hanging over his head, adding a layer of stress to what should be a happy time. The clock's ticking, and Rice knows he has to figure out a way to fix this mess before Phil loses patience. The stakes are high, and the tension's building, leaving everyone on edge as they wait to see how it all plays out. 7. Freddy discovers the truth. 
Bobby finally realizes he's been taking Anna for granted and steps up to apologize, hoping to make things right between them. But instead of easing the tension, his apology backfires when Anna learns that Gina has been meddling in their relationship. Anna's frustration quickly turns into anger, feeling betrayed by her sister's interference. What was supposed to be a moment of reconciliation with Bobby turns into another source of conflict, and Anna's left fuming. Things escalate between the sisters, with Anna and Gina getting into a heated argument. They're so caught up in their emotions that they don't even notice Freddy overhearing their conversation. When Freddy catches Gina confessing that Anna's in love with him, it throws him for a loop. It's a revelation he wasn't prepared for, and it leaves him reeling as he tries to process what this means for him and Anna. Despite his own growing feelings for Anna, Freddy decides that the best thing to do is to put some distance between them. He's torn between what he wants and what he thinks is right. But ultimately, he chooses to step back. Freddy's decision isn't an easy one, but he feels it's necessary to avoid complicating things even further. It's a tough call that leaves him and Anna on shaky ground, with their emotions and relationships more tangled than ever. 8. Johnny blames Gina The tension reaches a boiling point as paramedics rush into the Vic to treat Linda, who's in a bad way. Johnny's world comes crashing down as he watches, helpless, while they work to stabilize his mum. The fear and worry are almost too much to bear as he races to the hospital, praying for any bit of good news. Every minute feels like an eternity, and the weight of the situation hangs heavy over him. At the hospital, Johnny is a mess of emotions. Fear, guilt and anger all mixed together. He's desperate for someone to blame and his frustration quickly turns toward Gina. Convinced that her actions led to this moment, he lashes out, telling her she needs to leave. The strain of it all is tearing everyone apart, and Johnny's decision to push Gina away only adds to the heartbreak and chaos of an already unbearable situation. 9. Junior is interrupted. Junior has plans for a cozy night with Cindy, inviting her over for a late night glass of wine. Cindy, eager to spend time with him, gets ready and makes up a story to her family so she can sneak out. Everything seems to be falling into place for Junior, who's looking forward to the evening. But just as he's waiting for Cindy to arrive, there's an unexpected knock at the door. It's Gina, looking distraught, and asking if she can move in after being kicked out by Johnny. Junior is caught off guard by her sudden request, knowing that Cindy could show up any moment. He's torn between helping Gina and the situation he's about to step into with Cindy. In the end, Junior decides he can't take Gina in, leaving her feeling rejected and hurt. It's a tough call that leaves everyone in an uncomfortable spot, with Junior worried about what's coming next. 10. Johnny gets things wrong. As Linda's condition keeps Johnny on edge at the hospital, Callum steps up as a true friend, offering comfort and a shoulder to lean on. In the midst of all the stress and emotional turmoil, Johnny finds himself overwhelmed by the support and kindness Callum is showing him. It's a moment where everything feels confusing, and in his vulnerability, Johnny misreads the situation and leans in to kiss Callum, mistaking friendship for something more. Callum is caught completely off guard by Johnny's unexpected move. It's an awkward and uncomfortable moment for both of them, as Callum quickly pulls away, unsure how to react. He knows Johnny is going through a lot, and while he understands the confusion, it doesn't make the situation any less complicated. The tension hangs in the air as Callum tries to figure out how to handle this without making things worse for Johnny, all while trying to maintain their friendship during such a difficult time. And that's your sneak peek at the explosive week ahead in EastEnders. From shocking confrontations to unexpected twists, it's clear that Walford is never short of drama. Things are heating up, and we're all in for a wild ride. If you're as excited as we are, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more EastEnders updates and spoilers. Let us know in the comments which storyline you're most looking forward to, and we'll catch you in the next video.